Yo what's up guys my name is Haki and welcome to how to get pure white F1 wheels on any vehicle in GTA 5 online and I already know you guys are gonna love this video. Basically if you don't know there's no option to put ice white colored rims on vehicles in GTA 5 online. I don't know why this isn't a thing I mean it's just a color on rims but you can't. I'm gonna show you guys how you guys can get these pure white colored rims on any of your vehicles in GTA. If you go on to enjoy this video and you do find it helpful make sure you drop a like on it subscribe if you're new join the hacky army on the to 20k because you guys do not want to miss any of these types of videos in the future make sure you got the bell turned on so you actually get notified whenever there's a new awesome video like this going up and also if you want to go subscribe to my second channel as well that would be awesome i would really appreciate that but without further ado let's get into this all right so getting into the requirements for this so you guys will need an arena workshop you'll need a sinking xl just like this you guys will also need a car to get the wheels off of so if you guys want to get f1 wheels have an f1 car if you guys want to get benny's wheels Make sure you guys have a Benny's car. And you guys also want to get the car that you want to get the wheels on. So that could be pretty much any car. And make sure the car that you want to get the wheels off of and on. Make sure they're both in the arena workshop. But pretty much you guys are going to start this process on this road right here under Sandy Shores Airfield. And I actually made a full video on what you guys need to do for the first step. I'll link it down below in the description. But basically, make sure you guys get a sanking. This could be a sanking off the street or off the San Andreas Super Auto site. Make sure you guys are on this road. Make sure you guys start driving incredibly slow. So just like tap the gas button over and over and over again. And make sure you guys are here from about 8 a.m. in game time to about like 5 p.m. in game time. So right now I think it's about like 12 p.m. Uh, in game. So make sure you guys turn your camera angle to the right as well. And once again, make sure you guys drive fairly slow. And pretty much we're trying to get a, uh, a modded Saiyan King to spawn in for us. They spawn in a blue color and a yellow color. We're looking for the yellow one. Alright, so let's see if it is there. And boom! First freaking try! We got the yellow modded Sand King first freaking try. And let me show you guys why we specifically want the white uh, Sand King. Or not the white, I mean the yellow Sand King. They might look like regular rims at first, but if you go into LS Customs, you'll actually see these are the ice white or pure white colored uh, rims. So let me show you guys the difference. So as you guys can see, the same exact wheels. I go into wheels, I go into wheel color. And let me show you guys. Let me go down to frost white since that is the closest thing to the pure white rims. Look at frost white and then I'm going to back out. Boom! We have found the pure white wheels. Now... I'm going to be showing you guys how you guys can get it on any other car. Alright, so once you guys got it, you guys want to put full insurance and coverage on it. And then you guys want to store it in your Arena Workshop garage. Alright, so once you got your sinking in your Arena Workshop, few more requirements now. You guys want to set your spawn location to anywhere besides the Arena Workshop or last location. So I did the Arcadius Business Center. And second thing is, make sure you set your targeting mode to free aim. Now, if you didn't set it to free aim yet, don't worry. It's all good. You're going to be able to set it to free aim when we go in story mode in a bit. Because we're going to be joining someone in assisted aim later on. And most people that play GTA are on assisted aim. So that shouldn't really be a problem. And for the very first final requirement make sure you guys have an rc bandito as well this is crucial also if you guys did just change your spawn location to anywhere besides the arena workshop or last location make sure you guys switch your outfit as well in style just like this just to make sure it's saved so orange circle on the bottom now we know it officially is saved so what you guys want to do go up to your rc bandito click right on the d-pad and then you guys want to wait a few seconds and then go ahead and load up the youtube app if you're on ps4 Go ahead and load up, I think it's the Spotify app or the YouTube app, any any one of those I think. But once you guys are in the YouTube app, wait a few seconds, this would be a great time to go ahead and drop a like, subscribe if you're new. And then after a few seconds, go ahead and load back into GTA and you're going to see it's going to glitch you under the map and then it's going to say quitting session on the bottom right. Alright, so once you guys are in story mode, once again, make sure you guys set your targeting mode to free aim if it wasn't on free aim yet. And then just make sure you guys go into an invite only session. So once you guys load into online again, what you guys want to do, you guys want to avoid using any personal vehicle whatsoever. So don't call in a personal vehicle, don't use it whatsoever. So just exit to ground and drive back to your arena in a street vehicle. Alright, so once you guys get back into your arena, go ahead and get in your sanking. And you guys want to change one thing 
on the car. And before you do change anything on the car, as you press right D-pad, you're going to see you're still in your parking spot. So if it actually takes you into the workshop, which it usually does, uh, you did something wrong. Make sure you're still in your parking spot, change one thing, and then go ahead and sell your vehicle. You're not actually going to sell it, you're going to be stuck in an infinite black screen. So go ahead and press sell. And from here, you guys just want to go ahead and join any friend and assistant aim. Getting GTA Online session details and what you guys want to do here, accept the first alert and decline the second alert. You're going to be back in the session as normal. So get out of the Sand King and then make sure you guys get in your F1 car. Uh, now, if you want to do this with the Benny's car, make sure you guys get in the Benny's car. And now from here, just go ahead and drive out. And boom, you guys are going to see you have the uh, the ice white or the pure white uh, wheels on the F1 car now and make sure you guys get out of it. Once you get out of it, you're going to see it's going to despawn and it's actually going back into your arena. And from here, just go back into your arena. All right, so when you get back into your arena, go ahead and change the parking spot of the car you just put the wheels on. So I'm going to change it to right here and make sure you guys change your outfit as well so you get the orange uh, loading screen or the orange like save icon on the bottom right there it is all right so now we are officially set to go ahead and merge it onto the actual vehicle so let's go ahead and press right on the d-pad and we're gonna change it to actual f1 wheels so after you guys merge it with the thanking you want to change it back into uh into f1 wheels so let's go ahead and go into wheels and we want to make sure the color stays which is exactly what's going on here all right so Perfect. So make sure you guys do not change the color because this is the pure white color we want to keep. And let me show you guys the difference between the frost white and the uh, the ice white, the pure white. Once again, so as you guys can see, this is the frost white and then I click B. And you guys can see that is the pure white colored uh, rims. Wow, that looks so much better, honestly. And a lot of you guys from the last video had trouble where it only merges the color onto the uh, car and not the wheels themselves. So what you guys want to do to uh, to avoid that happening, you guys want to actually, you guys want to go into tire design and you guys want to select anything besides the stock tires. So you can't actually merge the stock tires. You got to choose any one of these. What you guys want to do, same exact process. Go up to your RC Bandito. Once again, make sure your spawn location is set to anywhere besides the, uh, the arena workshop. Or last location, click right on the D-pad and then go into YouTube. This is another great chance to go ahead and drop a like and everything. And I know I'm kind of plugging myself again mid-video. Go back into GTA 5 after a few seconds. It's going to glitch you under the map and it should say quitting session. Alright, so go into online and make sure you guys load in to an invite only session. If your spawn location is a little bit far away, I think you can also use a CEO buzzard. So if you wanna go ahead and become a CEO and call in a buzzard, I think that works as well. All right, so once you're back in your arena, get in your F1 car or Benny's car. If you're doing it with Benny's wheels, click right on the D-pad. And once again, you're gonna see it's gonna keep you in your parking spot. Go ahead and change one thing on the car and then go to sell car and go ahead and sell it. And now once again, go ahead and join a friend in assisted aim. All right, so just like last time, accept the first alert, decline the second, and you're gonna be back in the session as normal. Now get in the car you wanna put the wheels on, which in this case is gonna be the Zaba. So go ahead and drive out and you guys will see, whoa. <laughs> Holy crap, what is this freaking car? Dude, I have not seen wheels bigger than that in GTA 5 Online. So what you guys want to do from here, exit the vehicle, and you guys will see it's going to disappear. It's going back into your arena, and then go back into your arena yourself. All right, so to officially save it, just like last time, you want to go ahead and change the parking spot of the car you just put the wheels on. So the Zab, I'm going to change it with the F1, and then go ahead and change your outfit so you guys see the uh, the orange circle on the bottom right. So change the outfit and there it is. Perfect. So we have officially saved it. I'm going to go ahead and change the colors actually. There you guys go. Look, that just looks, I don't know if you guys can tell, but that looks so much wider than like frost white. I don't know. The pure white just looks a lot better. And hopefully you did go on to enjoy this video. Once again, if you did, go ahead, drop a like, subscribe if you're new, join the Hacky Army on the road to 20k. Make sure you got the bell turned on as well. Anyway, though, this has been Hacky. I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a great yesterday day and peace.